So overall, the cons might just outweigh the pros when it comes to using nootropics to increase or decrease quantities of specific neurotransmitters. But that is not to say there's no way to effectively increase your brain power with a little outside assistance. The key is simply to switch your focus to your long-term brain health rather than trying to get an immediate boost to your intelligence. And doing this is very easy with the right diet. Now, diet is absolutely essential for brain health, and many of us don't realise just how critical it is in this regard. Now, let's take a look at just some of the nutrients and supplements that you can use to enhance your brain power. Amino acids are the building box of protein. When you eat any meat, your brain will break it down into the amino acids and then recombine those to build tissues around your body. These tissues include those in the brain, so consuming more amino acids can be used to actually improve the body's ability to repair and grow the brain. But this is not where the importance of amino acids ends. Amino acids are also crucial for creating many neurotransmitters. For example, L-tyrosine is used to create dopamine, whereas triphotophan, discussed earlier, is used to create serotonin. Others, like I-theanine, can have a direct effect on the brain, and in this case, it's something of a calming effect. L-carnitine, meanwhile, has an energy-boosting effect on the brain by increasing the performance of the mitochondria. More on that in a second. As we've seen with 5-HTP, it's possible to consume many of these amino acids on their own in order to trigger immediate changes in the levels of neurotransmitters. However, this leads to imbalances, as we've discovered, and despite popular opinion, this is never a positive thing. So instead, the best advice is to focus on trying to get a healthy mix of as many amino acids as possible. By simply eating lots of protein or supplementing with amino acid products, it's possible to provide the brain with all the materials it needs to create all of the different neurotransmitters as and when it needs them. This makes it better at entering any mental state and ensures that you can maximise your focus, concentration, memory and relaxation all at the same time. The best way to conveniently get lots of amino acids? Well, it's to consume plenty of eggs. Eggs are one of the only complete proteins, meaning they contain all of the amino acids that the brain doesn't create on its own. On top of this, they also contain choline, which is the precursor to excitatory neurotransmitter acetylcholine. They're a great source of healthy saturated fat too, and seeing as the brain is predominantly made from fat, this is also a very important and beneficial factor. The same goes for countless vitamins and minerals. These two are used to create a lot of the neurotransmitters that are so highly sought after by people trying to enhance their productivity and focus. Vitamin B6 in particular is used to create a huge number of neurotransmitters. Vitamin C, meanwhile, is key for increasing serotonin and boosting the mood, while also providing protection against illness, which brings with it cytokines, which is an inhibitory neurotransmitter. And there are plenty of other roles for vitamins and minerals too. Iron and vitamin B12 both help with blood flow by producing more red blood cells. Vitamin D helps with the regulation of hormones, especially testosterone. Zinc plays a key role in enhancing neuroplasticity. Magnesium, meanwhile, helps to combat depression and anxiety. In short, if you're not getting the micronutrients you need, you're not giving your brain everything it needs to function optimally. And this is why you need to avoid processed foods. Anything very artificial like a candy bar, bag of crisps or a burger will contain calories to fill you up, but won't contain the nutrients you need to function. You'll stay alive, but you'll feel tired, sluggish, and far less productive as a result. Eat healthy salads, smoothies, and lots of fruit and veg, and you'll find that you start feeling healthier and more alert. The next best thing is a multivitamin, and if you get the right one of these, it can do a lot to improve the function of your brain, as well as your overall health and well-being. 
If you're looking for an immediate brain boost that you can get from safe supplements and foods, then look for vasolidators. A vasolidator is any substance that dilates the blood vessels, in other words, the veins and arteries. These will allow you more blood and more oxygen to get around the body, which in turn will result in more making it to your brain. A particular favourite among nootropic fans is vimprocetine, because this vasolidator focuses on the brain specifically and the prefrontal cortex even more specifically. This means you're getting more energy right to the part of the brain that you use for planning and problem solving, and some people describe the feeling as being like a cold shower for your brain. Cognitive metabolic enhancers is a fancy term for anything that increases your brain's energy levels, and often this means things that will increase the efficiency of your mitochondria. Mitochondria are the energy factories of your cells. They float around inside the cytoplasm and they use glucose at ATP to power your body functions, including brain function. Numerous things can help your mitochondria to perform better, and these include CoQ10, lutein, L-cartinine, PQQ and more. In other words, a mixture of amino acids, vitamins, minerals and all kinds of lesser known nutrients available in supplement form. Again, the best strategy is just to eat a very balanced and nutritious diet, but you can also increase your energy levels further by using creatine. Creatine is a supplement that is very often used by athletes and bodybuilders. Its main function is to convert used ATP back into more usable ATP. In other words, it recycles adenosine, which thereby provides you with extra energy to use in your training. The more recent surprise, though, is that this also enhances brain function by improving the energy efficiency of brain cells. Basically, it allows the brain to recycle its ATP too, which means you get just a second or two of extra energy at maximum exertion. Studies show that individuals who take creatine get a slight boost in their IQ, so this is definitely a very effective nootropic, and one with zero side effects or risks. Creatine is produced naturally in the liver and can also be obtained from your diet, you know, sources such as beef. However, the best way to see a significant boost is to use it in supplement form. Look for creatine monohydrate. Omega-3 fatty acid is a great antioxidant that is found in tuna and other oily fish, as well as some nuts and various other sources. What makes omega-3 useful for the brain, though, is the fact that it can improve cell membrane permeability. Essentially, this means it makes the cell walls of the neurons just a little bit more permeable, thereby allowing things to pass through a little more easily. That includes neurotransmitters, nutrients and more. So it essentially makes brain cells more responsive and thereby gives you a slight boost yet again. Antioxidants are key for looking after your brain's long-term health. These include vitamin C, omega-3, resveratrol and tons of other micronutrients. Essentially, antioxidants work by destroying free radicals, and these are substances that damage cells when they come into contact with them, and which can even lead to cancer if they make it through the nucleus and cause damage to the DNA. Consuming antioxidants is a very important strategy for your overall health, and will also help you to reduce your likelihood of illness by strengthening your immune system. However, what we're interested in right now is how this can boost your brain power in the long term by protecting brain cells from damage and potentially lowering your chances of developing tumors later in life. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.